click the bell, turn on all notifications, and subscribe for around-the-clock WWE news in real time. The home of the most consistent and dedicated breaking news in WWE, Sean's View Ends, is here for you. Like, comment, and share today. Welcome to the fresh brew that we bring and introduce to you the rumors, the news, the headlines, the debates, the fantasy booking, the hot takes. This is your one-stop destination, your one prominent place for all things WWE. And remember, viewers, fans, and subscribers, if it weren't for you, there would be no Sean's View. We come through when the lights are on bright. Become a channel member today. Make sure to donate with a super thanks donation by clicking the dollar sign below. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to do it in stereo. As revealed from the breaking rumors, the breaking headlines, the game, Triple H. Remember to share this video all over the entire internet, whether it be Facebook, whether it be Twitter, whether it be X, whether it be Instagram, whether it be TikTok, wherever it may be, Snapchat. Remember, this is your premier place for everything WWE. Now, let's get into the monumental announcement by the game, Triple H, who is undoubtedly that damn good. Now, we do have several topics to get to, though, but before we get into that major announcement, as seen on Friday SmackDown, Austin Theory squared off against Tommaso Ciampa with Grayson Waller and Johnny Gargano present alongside respective partners. However, according to a whole new report by Sean Ross Sapp on Fightful Select, it was revealed that the original plans listed Grayson Waller and Johnny Gargano as part of the WWE commentary team for that match. Now, Tommaso Ciampa would then pick up the win over Austin Theory after Grayson Waller inadvertently caused the distraction possibly showing the seeds of an eventual breakup. We'll have to wait and see how the storyline will progress in the coming weeks. Also, Ethan Page pulls out of an indie event after his WWE NXT debut. Now, Ethan Page is the same guy, the same superstar, the same wrestler that said, oh, yeah, I showed up in NXT, but I didn't sign a contract. But yet he's pulling out of indie events. Hmm. Something just doesn't seem to add up right there. Also, Matt Cardona extends an open invitation to Becky Lynch for GCW Gauntlet of Survival. Now, we all know that Becky Lynch is officially a free agent. She's no longer with the WWE. She's no longer under contract with World Wrestling Entertainment. Is Becky Lynch going to join another entity, another promotion, another industry? We're going to have to wait and see on that one. Also, the WWE's a WWE star, a massive star who is known the world over. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. First, their first appearance after their WWE exit has been confirmed. Ladies and gentlemen, Drew Gulak's first w post-WWE appearance. And Swerve Strickland believes that now is the best time for an AEW and WWE crossover. And the sentiments, those sentiments are believed to be going to be echoed by the game Triple H. Because we're seeing partnerships, we're seeing teams we're seeing WWE get into other wrestling, not just TNA, because we all know WWE just had that TNA partner. It's, it's just not TNA. There is a firm belief that we will see the floodgates open between WWE and AEW, and the game would be the one. Triple H would be the one to make that mega announcement for WWE and AEW. Your thoughts, your comments, your opinions. Would you want to see a WWE Open day between TNA, AEW, WWE. It would definitely rumble the entire uh, landscape of professional wrestling. Speaking about rumblings, ladies and gentlemen, Uncle Howdy Mystery takes over WWE website with a massive takeover. Ladies and gentlemen, the WWE website was hacked earlier with the Uncle Howdy presence. Your thoughts, your comments and your opinions on that. Also, Jack Perry was spotted driving his skateboat bus with Anna J. And as we always do, we always, we always sprinkle in some AEW and TNA, but primarily, this is a WWE channel. Also, Liv Morgan flaunts her WWE Women's World title at the Bad Boys 4 movie, Red 
carpet event. Your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions on that. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your one-stop destination for all WWE, and we do it in real time because we make it favorable for every one of you guys. Now, I've done two other videos earlier. Please go check out my two other videos from earlier today. Remember, we do multiple videos a day. We keep you in the know, and we don't silence anybody because we do it from the get-go. Subscribe.